Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we have, a, once again, another unboxing of a model. This is um, one that Gemini Jets released not too long ago, um, so I'm excited to have it. It is going to expand my regional fleet once again. Um, so over Christmas I got, what was that? One, two, three, four, two to four models, regional. It is an American Airlines model, so we're going to get straight into the unboxing. So, yes, um, I, I really try to uh, expand my American fleet, but I don't want to go overboard. I may have gone overboard, but I try to spread um, my model stuff out. Um, I, I like to get, uh, I like that I got a Delta, multiple Deltas for Christmas. That is, um... I, I actually very, very oh my knife is so dull bro it's not cutting it's cutting into the box anyways on to um not me uh, messing up in life kind of happens with these unboxings yeah, so this uh, model was <laughs> actually ordered. On, I cut the slip really badly straight down the middle. But the model was ordered on January 5th, 2022. Um, quick little thing for the new Gemini Jets releases. I'm going to not do a video on them this month, but next in March. I'm going to do that, but uh, the inflation has gone up for a CRG 200. $47 where I got this one is $35, $37, including taxes, um, so all that, so it really went, it went up basically by 10, it's going to be at 49 when they, uh, you get it with the sales tax and everything, which kind of gets annoying, but here's the box and the model. Here is the box of the model. For a little bit of a scale size, this box is the size of the 767, but the model is about that size. So, the boxes I think are a little bit too big, but it's whatever. So, it's the American and Barrett EJ 175, one of 400 scale American Airlines. As real as it gets on the back, it always has all your info. On the pan flip, you still have the uh, traditional information all through there. There's the model. It is a little bit, just a tad bit dark. Kind of reminds me of the A320 Gemini Jets release. Um, but if it is a little bit darker than um, us collectors want, we can't help it. Gemini Jets are the people who make the models, so it looks better, um, it looks way better actually than when it did in the, in the box. So getting out of the box, there it is, okay. so a few minor things, I already can see that we have some wheel damage done to the bottom, you can all uh, tell. This one is kind of crooked. This one isn't. Uh, nothing is broken for what I see of right now. So that's really good. Not a broken model. FYI, this model broke um, off camera. The tail, these two things just flop right off. It's okay. I fixed it with uh, our favorite super glue. But I actually had it um, on standby just in case. We did need to repair the model, but it doesn't look like we do. Yeah, the model is not actually as dark as this one. It's definitely a darker model. Ah! Definitely a darker model, but it's not worse. Not as bad. So that, that, that's really good. So we're going to start the review. Obviously, as all the other model reviews go. We got the nose cone, carpet windows, L1 door, American Eagle titles right there. 
the engines on this aircraft, which are the the engines is 2X GE CF 34B. Eight key engines. Um, we'll get to the wings in a minute. The gear is good. Uh, you got the exit there and the um, tail, which looks really, really good. The registration on this model, which can be kind of seen, is right there. It is November 233. And then. So we're gonna take a little look at the wings because uh, we've had some issues. Um, yeah. Okay. Um, sorry, but what is that? My Gemini Jets. That is way too. Way, 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 way too. Just a wing flex. Ugh. Model's great, but the wings on this model, but like, compared to the Herpa, like that's good. That's that's just absurd. Apart from the wings, the model is a good model, I will have to say. Will I get another one? Nope. Um, will I get another EJ 145? Maybe. Um, it, it's a good model, but I think this looks really good with um, my models that are now new livery which I I have a CRJ 200 but I don't use it as much as I used to but those are my three main regional models that actually look really really good but apart from that I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did don't forget to like and subscribe as always if you have not already this model is good I will have to say but apart from that have a great day everybody bye